In this video, you'll see how to subscribe to and deploy a container-based product from AWS Marketplace using Amazon Elastic Container Service Anywhere or Amazon ECS Anywhere. With Amazon ECS Anywhere, you can now deploy container workloads on your managed infrastructure to leverage existing infrastructure investments or to meet regulatory and data residency requirements. In conjunction with AWS Marketplace, you can now find, subscribe to, and deploy container applications on Amazon ECS Anywhere easily. Amazon ECS Anywhere is a new capability in Amazon ECS that enables customers to easily run and manage container-based applications on-premises, including on virtual machines, bare metal servers, and other customer-managed infrastructure. To get started, we'll create an Amazon ECS cluster. Let's use the networking-only template, which supports serverless AWS Fargate infrastructure or external instances like an on-premises server or a virtual machine. Next, we'll configure the cluster. The cluster was created successfully. Now let's register an external virtual machine. We'll create a new role for this instance. Let's copy this command for later when we register the virtual machine in our Amazon ECS cluster. Now we'll connect to our virtual machine using AWS Cloud Shell. Let's switch to the root user and paste in the registration command so we can begin the installation. The installation process takes about 5 minutes. In the Amazon ECS console, we can refresh to see that the external virtual machine has connected to our Amazon ECS cluster. Now let's subscribe to a container-based product from AWS Marketplace. We'll use AWS Deep Learning Containers for PyTorch. It takes a few minutes to process the subscription once we've accepted the terms. We can now configure and launch the software. Let's view the container image we'll use to deploy the product. We'll copy the URL for the Docker images to use later when we adjust our container settings. Now let's navigate to the AWS Deep Learning Containers page to access instructions for deploying the container via our Amazon ECS cluster. Let's view the training materials for PyTorch. Here we can see the task definition we need to deploy our container using Amazon ECS Anywhere. Let's save a copy of the task definition to use later. Now let's return to the Amazon ECS console. From the task definitions page, we'll create a new task definition using the external instance launch type and configure it with JSON. Let's replace the default content with the PyTorch task definition we copied, which contains example data for demo purposes. Please note, you'll need to update the Docker command passed into the container instance at launch to use your actual data for training. Now let's adjust the task definition settings. We'll rename the definition to match the Amazon ECS cluster we created, and then define the task role and task execution role to provide the necessary permissions for the task to be executed properly. You can find instructions on how to create this IAM role in the description and links for this video. Now let's adjust the container definitions. Here we'll replace the default image settings with the Docker container image URL we copied earlier. You can also adjust the memory limit settings. Let's change the memory limit to 2000 megabytes, which is suitable for our external virtual machine. Let's allow Amazon ECS to automatically configure CloudWatch logs so that we can monitor, store, and access our log files using ECS Anywhere. Now let's create the task definition. Finally, let's deploy the task definition to ECS Anywhere. We'll select the external launch type and then run the task. It can take about 5 minutes from the time the status changes to running until the task is actively running. Let's visit our CloudWatch console to confirm the task operations. We can see that the container is actively logging and data processing is in progress. We have successfully deployed AWS Deep Learning Containers for PyTorch with Amazon ECS Anywhere. You've just seen how to subscribe to and deploy a container-based product from AWS Marketplace using Amazon ECS Anywhere.
You can learn more about this topic in the description and links for this video. Thanks for watching. Now it's your turn to try.